What's up guys? DCK here. Uh, finally, getting back on track with the year in review series. Um, I'm just going to already distract myself about 15 seconds in. Sweet. I didn't know what to do with the hair, so I just pointed it down like this. It was like, damn, damn it, get it even. Alright, there we go. If you want to complain about it, put it in the comments. Lord knows I don't get comments as it is. Whatever. Pro Wrestling Noah will be uh, this video's, this year in review video's uh, main discussion point. Pro Wrestling Noah um, had a good year. Um, here's here's my thing with uh, with Noah. I think uh, the, the, I think because of how uh, Noah and New Japan have been relating the past. Uh, uh, you know the past two years it's 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 a little bit hard for me to get an idea of you know it, it does kind of hinder your your focus on your, your how you see the health of the product or the promotion um because because they really have a uh, interacted a lot uh i mean you can see on the past you know the past three wrestle kingdom shows have been a lot of weight has been put into uh, some New Japan versus NOAA uh, matches. Uh, some really big, big deals. Um, so, so it was kind of weird. But I mean, I've, enjo I've enjoyed the NOAA versus New Japan a lot. I think there's a lot of good matchups. Um, especially, especially Shizaki versus Nakamura, which, you know, someday those guys will have a match with. Uh, will have just the right amount of time and do just the right stuff to have just an amazing amazing match like a just a baller baller match you know a part of me thinks that um a part of me thinks that you know they might end it they might be ending it you know after uh wrestle kingdom 5 but uh ending that feud but i hope not because they have such freaking good matches um, um and look at and the guys and, and the guys that Noah got are do, are doing really well. Uh, I've really just enjoyed their work. Um, like I mentioned in the last one, how I think Goto and Nakamura are going to be the yin and yang of uh, yin yin and yang of uh, New Japan. Shizaki and Sugira, um, at least for a while, are going to be yin and yang. Just tear it up and really just kind of have this this uh, I don't know just this something about them uh, that'll be great and I mean there's gonna be other guys that are gonna get featured a lot and do well um, you know, Jun Akiyama's still doing his thing I think he's still working pretty well Kensuke Sasaki is uh, is showing some good stuff um, more Shima's busting it out like a mofo uh, Kenta, Marufuji, Atsushi Aoki, uh, Katara Suzuki, even Kanemaru. Just, just some solid, solid names in there. Um, and, and I'm sure there's some guys I'm forgetting. You know, and then there's the New Japan guys they bring in. The freelance guys like Takayama. Takayama's played a decent part in um, Noah this year. Um, yay. He's, he's an ugly motherfucker. He's an ugly motherfucker. But he's he's a, he's a hell of a big man. Uh, still does really good job there. Um, so let's talk about my top three pro wrestling Noah matches um, for 2010. Um, number three, I'm going to put Kenta versus Marufuji uh, from the Navigation with a Breeze, which was uh, I believe end of May, beginning of June. Uh, Kenta's big return match, awesome match, very very well done. Um, on any in any, I think in, I'm sure in some year that would be even higher, but I think it was awesome, uh, considering that this was a return match, which when you know, Marufuji's return match wasn't nearly on this level, but then again, I think Marufuji's return match had some different purpose to it, so what have you. Uh, number two, I'm going to put 
uh, yet another. I mean, Kensuke, uh, with Takashi Sugira had some amazing tile defenses. Yeah, two Sugira. Um, sorry. Some I don't know. Something's going on. Like someone's like fixing a sink or something. Um, two Sugira in my mind. So my number two match is Sugira versus Shizaki from uh, the September 26th No Show. Even better than uh, the match where Sugira won the title. Even better. It was awesome. Good, 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 you know, good exchange of junk. And, you know, some good psychology. Uh, yeah, all that good stuff. Uh, and number one, my favorite Japanese match of the year. It's uh, Takashi Sagira defending against Takeshi Morishima. Morishima looked like a goddamn monster. Um, th he should, I think, you know, after that performance, he should be the guy who uh, eventually takes the title off of Sagira. He was, a, he was a beast, and Sagira made a really good, realistic comeback against a guy against a guy the size and bruteness of Morishima. Um, yeah, so you you guys can tell I've become a big Sagira fan. I mean, I'm still uh, Sagira and Shizaki. I'm just big fans of, and I uh, I, ho I hope they keep tearing it up. As, you know, as two of the main guys. Uh, yeah, and there are other guys who still have their place in the promotion. Um, yeah, I I enjoyed Pro Cena a lot, and I hope they do well. Hoorah. Sorry about the interruption in the middle. I don't like people creeping on my videos. Just don't like it. Alright guys. Double Cross King. Stay classy. Um, I think next I'll do... Dragon Gate? I guess? Probably. Probably Dragon Gate. Alright. Stay classy everybody.